Hello guys, today I am going to teach you how to set and also get or in other words parse a cookie in Express. So first of all uh, you will need this NPM or this model or this middleware that it's called cookie parser. Cookie parser is a middleware that will help you uh, parse cookies from the request body so or, or from the request from the request object <clears throat> so you install this model as I did and you will be ready okay so once installed this model let's take a look at the code <coughs> I have a note here that says you will need to require the cookie parser middleware okay you require the, the middleware then the the usual the express uh, the express and uh, declaring the app. Then uh, put the cookie parser or uh, take a look the cookie parser executed because this function executed will return a middleware. You can just do this because it will not return a middleware. You need to do this and also inside this you can do a secret and so on but that's not for this tutorial this trend is going to teach you how to set or how to parse uh, normal cookies just in the normal way so put the cookie parser function as a middleware and it will save the cookies in uh, the cookies property from the request object this is the request object so as you can see here I set the root path uh, that it's the root path uh, with the middleware here. Remember that to add a new middleware to the root, you just need to add a comma, and that's what I did. Added the middleware, and then my own middleware that is here. I grab the request object and the response object, and then I answer with the JSON method reg the cookies. So <clears throat> once the cookies are parsed in this middleware, it will save them in regular cookies, right? So when we want to access the cookie, the client cookies, or just yes, the client cookies, you just need to cookie parser uh, stores the cookies in regular cookies. Okay, I forgot that now. So you you just need to you just need to return this and this will contain an object with the cookies. I'm gonna run it just to check what I got. Okay, as you can see I just got this default cookie. Um, but what I got is the the objects are representing the cookies, right? Then I set a, I set a new route that is set cookie with a param that is name. Remember that with the double point you can set params in Express. If you don't know this, just check another video of how to set params and investigate about that. Then I do a, an if condition if reg.params.name is set I will execute the following right so to set a cookie you use the response cookies method that is response object and the cookie method the first argument is the name of the cookie the second argument is the value of the cookie the third argument are the options of the cookie and the most common options are match age and expires. Match age is the lifetime of the cookie in milliseconds and expires is the expire date of the cookie in the Greenwich Mean Time. Um, so I will just use match age and as you can see I use the response object with the cookie method. Then with red dot parents the name I grab the name I want set the value hello and in the options I just set mat a, mat's age to 10 seconds 
why 10 seconds? Because I'm multiplying by 1000, so it will be uh, 10,000 milliseconds that is translated to uh, 10 seconds. Then I send this response cookie and then the name of the cookie and then set. For example, cookie potatoes is set. And if no name is parsed, then I will just I will send uh, put a cookie name, right? I forgot this. Sorry. Okay, I will just send put a cookie name and just put the server listening. So let's check it out how it works. And uh, as you can see here, if I go to the root uh, set cookie without a uh, name, uh, I don't get anything, right? For example, if I do Pepe, then cookie Pepe is set. If I do potatoes, then cookie potatoes is set. If I go to the main, I have the potatoes cookie set to. And if I reload, I don't have the cookies anymore, and that's because I put a max age of 10 seconds. If, for example, I prolong that to 30 seconds, uh, say run the app again, run the app, I, I think I have some errors, but let's, let's continue the tutorial. <laughs> Set cookie and again Pepe, then set cookie potatoes. And as you can see, if I go to the main, I have pepe cookies and potatoes cookies. And that's all. I hope is useful for you. And bye.